sitting in my underwear on a Saturday, cranking out a super short video for you guys for if you're interested in a Silicon Valley internship, uh, which is also how I got started, where it was a paid internship. The number one thing that most people in the general population of undergrads at Ivy schools or good, good public schools is housing. And this is a counterintuitive way to solve the housing issue, is that is to solve someone else's problem first. And that problem is VCs and angel investors are looking for the next crop of entrepreneurs. And you're like, whoa, I haven't even gotten to Silicon Valley yet. How am I even thinking about being an entrepreneur when I would just like to really work at Uber, Facebook, Amazon, Duck9, Yahoo, Google, uh, Uber again? Because this is how it started with Uber, and I'm going to bring it full circle for housing. Ryan Graves reached out to Travis and Garrett over Twitter and asked, Hey, uh, are you guys looking for help for work? And he, he being Ryan Graves, bit.ly, bit.ly, rgraves711, or sorry, 710, bit, grab a pen, bit.ly, rgraves, r for Ryan, g r a v e s 710, bit.ly, rgraves710. Ended up being the first employee because of a tweet. So that is a paid internship where you're basically volunteering and starting to do work before you get hired. So if you're solving the housing issue, you're gonna have to be earmarked as a person who can execute, as a person who can do. And I know you're sitting there saying, I barely even studied any CS, I'm not an expert in anything, but if you're a sophomore with a heartbeat, you are literally handful of heartbeats away literally you know how like the vice president's one heartbeat away from being president what you don't realize as freshmen and sophomores is that you are a a, a a moment away from becoming a great founder so what are some steps for you to do right now some steps for you to do right now is to execute the startup of you incorporated so you got to start up you you probably don't have a Twitter, and there's a signature business recipe for how to start up Twitter. Your own Twitter account, which is a less, grab a pen for this stuff, please. I'm not saying this for my health. Less than minimum viable Twitter account. Less than minimum viable, I'm trying to get in better lighting here, I can't even get feedback. Less than minimum viable Twitter account. And it's basically 15 tweets, just write down the initials for L-T-M-V-T-A. It's 15 tweets and it's a glorified LinkedIn profile. What's important is that you're going to have to start up a slew of things and be not necessarily entrepreneurial, but have the, the foundation. Foundation is even a strong word that might intimidate you. You're trying to get going with executing. And the one thing that you're gonna execute, which is so counterintuitive, is you're gonna actually load up an Eventbrite and host an event in Silicon Valley, a town that you wanna go to you don't even have housing yet. So you're gonna to have to host, have to is a strong word too. You're going to potentially host an 11 minute party in a city that you don't live in yet. Now I know that seems weird or uh, scary, okay? These are things that everything that I'm doing and recommending that you do or mentoring you to do, that's a strong word too, other people have done prior to you. Even the concept of intern palooza, intern like an internship, palooza like Lala Palooza, which is P-A-L-O-O-Z-A. -O -O Sorry if you're from Singapore or China or some Asian faraway land and it sounds like I'm joking. I'm really not joking. It's real. Intern palooza is real. I want to say July 20th, 2014, Corey Levy. I bring up Corey Levy because he hosted not just an 11 minute party, which is a business subroutine, less than minimum viable party, LTMVP. These aren't acronyms, these are signature business subroutines. Corey Levy not only did a less than minimum viable party, he did a full two day conference at Stanford University. I mean, that's a top 50 school. It's a great school, right? 
he did Corey Levy at Corey on Twitter is twitter.com slash Corey if you want to read him. You don't have to follow people, you just type in the URL. He did a two-day conference as a junior in high school from Texas. You want to execute small things such as hosting an 11-minute party because along the lines of execution, you will get momentum from executing. I'm posting them on more down below and there's a there's a Google, Google the article, pop-up internship number four of five. Pop-up internship number four of five. Uh, Lisa Falzone has a pop-up internship. So basically it's a seven hour internship, a pop-up seven hour internship before you get a Silicon Valley internship because when you execute little things, and right now it's uh, April 3rd, uh, you'll be doing entrepreneurship, executing entrepreneurship before you become a intern in Silicon Valley, summer 2015. So to recap, you're solving your housing issue by having some promise and glimpses of entrepreneurial potential and the housing issue, I know this sounds so weird, but it'll magically solve itself. Remember, Ryan Graves became a billionaire by tweeting at Travis K. Uh, R. Graves, bit.ly, R. Graves, 710. Welcome to Silicon Valley from wherever your dorm room is.